Welcome back guys, I have another video for you guys today. Today I'll be showing how to install pedals, just in case you guys uh, need, to learn, uh, need to figure out how to install pedals. Uh, the pedals I'll be using today will be uh, Crank Brothers Mallet Ease. They look like, 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 like this, bam. USA Colors Limited Edition, 4th of July. Perfect, I was like, I need those for a USA frame, you know? Sticking on this USA uh, trend. I don't even know if these are made in the US. They probably are. And to put these on, you don't even need a pedal wrench. These are a size eight Allen key, eight millimeter Allen key. Um, you know, that's one of those things you gotta, gotta make sure you have. I got plenty of tools. Of course I have eight millimeter. Anyways, um, how, do you, how can you tell which one's left, which one's right? That's a, that's a good question. The best way I figured it out was you look at the threads, you can see the thread pitch is different. So one is going up, one's going down. So the thread pitch going up is your left pedal and your thread pitch going down is your right pedal. And look, I was right. So this is the thread pitch going up. This is the thread pitch going down. What do you guys think? What pedal's what? I think this is the right side, I could be wrong. I think this is the left side, I could be wrong. So what I'm gonna do is, if a thread's in there, a thread's in there. Uh, no, don't play that game, you're gonna overstrip the pedal. So most of the time they have indicators. This one actually has a little R, I just found that little R there. So this is the right pedal. If you guessed it, good job. If you didn't, good try. This is the left pedal. Good thing they didn't send me two rights or two lefts. I've had that happen before. Not from Crank Brothers, they're a different company. So when you're installing pedals, it's reverse thread. So you now usually you're going to go this way, this way, gonna go this way. I'll show you guys what I mean. Whenever you put pedals on, it's always best to grease your pedals. If you don't grease your pedals, they might not come off in the future. So grease I'll be using today, Shimano Premium Grease. I'm gonna slide that lid off, put a little bit of grease on the pedal. Even that much is good. Always want a little bit of grease. Uh, if you put too much, you're gonna have a fun mess to clean up. Just plain. Even that's fine. You know. I've put the lid back on, make sure it doesn't. Now we're here, good to go. So I'm gonna put the right pedal in first. Grab, grab your, this one's an eight mil. I'm gonna grab my eight mil. It's a big eight mil, I know. Uh, I usually just beat it through there so I don't drop it. There's eight, fits. Pretty snug in there. I uh, put the eight mil in there, connect it to the to the pedal, bring it to the um, crank, and I start. So I'm going in, and I start uh, tightening it up, going the right side, just like that. Now my pedal's in there. Want to make sure it's tight. So pedals. Don't have a uh, torque spec unless they specifically say use this certain torque. Um, and that's my pedal installed. Now, now it's always going to be bottom heavy until I install the other side. Even if I put it all the way up. And other than that, I mean, these pedals spin pretty decent. Of course, the brand new bearings. Do the same thing for the other side. Might be easier if I showed you guys right here. So, you know, stick your tool in there. Connect it with the pedal. I'm missing my little boot over here, but it's okay. And just thread towards the head tube. So now that I've threading that in there, it gets, gets easier, easier, easier. And then watch this. Keep hitting my frame. I don't like that. Stops. 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 Anyway, so after it stops, I'm gonna go ahead. Make sure that's tight, that's pretty tight. And now your cranks are even. My cranks are even, I like them even. Put your tool back, don't lose your tool. Put the tool back, bam, just like that. Uh, removal's pretty easy, just put your eight mil back in there and twist opposite way. Uh, other than that, that's how you install pedals. If you guys want me to remove pedals, I will do a video of how to remove pedals. Um, other than that, 
These will be the pedals I'll be running on this frame. I think those look pretty sick, honestly. I'm just looking at them, wish I could keep those on. I don't have any parts for this thing. The dream build won't be done this year. Just kidding, it might be. Um, other than that, you know, that's how you install these type of pedals. Uh, I have other types of pedals uh, that require a pedal wrench. Honestly, you don't even need a pedal wrench. You can use a 15 millimeter uh, wrench that does the exact same thing. Just uh, might, you know, might round out your pedal a little bit, but other than that, get them on and off pretty easy. Um, I kind of like the eight mil ones. They also have six mil ones, which is pretty nice because I have a special tool for the six mils. And other than that, these pedals, I've been rocking Frank Brothers for a while now. I have three sets, including this one. I have the downhill ones, which are red with the silver. I have the Enduro ones, which is the Mallet Ease, which are these ones, just blue. i grab those real quick if you guys want to see them. Be like, look like this, pretty beat up. These things are pretty durable. I, If you guys ride clips, Crank Brothers, if you guys want to start clips, I recommend these bad boys. They get hit all the time. You can see all the, see all the bump scratches. It's pretty nice. Even if I'm not wearing my clips that day, I can still run flat shoes and they still do the trick. You now just clip your foot in there, go in there. Another way you can also find out if it's a left or right pedal. It depends on where the um, pins are. So the, the pins are right there. You flip it over, pins are right there, which means this is the right pedal. Yeah, correct. That's the right pedal. Check at the top. It says right. So, you know, and that's how you're going to get your full use of pedals. If you guys have any questions, uh, put in the comments below. And, you know, maybe we might be doing a giveaway soon. I have not thought about it. If you guys want to see a giveaway, let me know. I will be gladly doing giveaways um, pretty soon. I got a, I'm going to be doing a bike check number one. I have a cool hardtail, funniest thing in the world, bike related anyways. I have a hardtail that should be coming up pretty soon. Uh, other than the hardtail, I got a downhill bike I can build full quick, show you guys that. I can even do a how to build a downhill bike pretty quick. Um, there's a lot of videos I could be doing for you guys. If you guys would like to see any even other videos, I can show you how to do that. Uh, I can show you guys how to install cassettes, remove cassettes, install free wheels, remove free wheels. I have a lot of random parts I can show you as well. I'll be showing, I can show you guys how to set up droppers. I know how to set up dropper seat posts, many of them. Uh, you know, I work at a bike shop. I'll just leave it at that for now. Um, other than that, I'd like to thank one of my, not really full sponsorship yet from Crank Brothers. It's a, what do you call it? I'm, I'm a Crank Brothers influencer. Show you guys my hat. Limited edition. 20 years on the mountain, Long Laguna Beach, California, 1997 to 2017, which means I've had this hat for two years now. Holy crap. It's funny when time flies, right? Yeah, so you know, that these are the pedals going on this bad boy. I guess I'd show you that. Uh, I'll do last. Show so you guys this one more thing out. Look at this. Bam. I see that star in the stripes. Of course you do. You know, uh, I'll be, be pretty stoked when this bike is built. It's going to be pretty cool. Um, other than, you know, it being built, how to videos. Just stay tuned. I'll keep you guys posted. Um, you know, I might have a, ooh, you know what? How to install a headset cup. Those, that's, that's what I'm talking about right there. Uh, anyway, so, you know, I was showing you guys everything on a bike. Uh, this is going to be a frame build, a dream build. So this one's going to be, take some time. I just had the parts laying around. I was like, you know what? I'll go ahead and throw them on today. Um, I'll be building up another bike. I'm not going to say which bike it is yet. That's going to be an altitude for you guys. It'll be the whole bike, except this one's going to be a hardtail. Other than it being a hardtail, it's going to be pretty simple, straightforward. Make, make you guys home mechanics, you know? That's the, that's the goal of this channel right now. Uh, I'll be also be posting videos there's already some videos posted of me riding my local trails. I'll be doing more of those. I will be doing 
uh, all sorts of things on this channel. And I know this is a pedal installation video. Now it's turning into a life video. I'm just kidding. Uh, if you guys want to see any anything, you know, I do other things. Hopefully bike related. Um, the video games. I, those are just posted those just because. Uh, other than that, I will be pretty stoked when this is built. I'm not going to say what parts I'm going to so stay tuned. I do have Instagram if you guys want to follow my Instagram. I do post a lot of pictures on there. It's like, uh, Instagram name will be, I'll just tell you my Instagram name. It is the Guzman, D-E-G-U-Z-M-A-N, and uh, underscore Kyle. And I'll put it in the uh, link below, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.